What's going on guys, Icespark here, and today I just wanted to make a little video in response to Vortex Vids, his Vortex Ventures, in which he made a mob grinder. I just wanted to show how you can make it with water, even though he said it didn't seem like it would be as easy. It's not actually too difficult to do. So, I'm in creative mode, so it will be a lot easier for me to do than for anybody that's in survival, but let's go ahead and start doing this. So you just want to... Water goes eight blocks, so just count eight blocks. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we want to go two back. Yes, there's a cave back here. Hold on, let me look. Let me just make sure, because right now... Yes, it is going to go too far, okay. So let's just break some of this. And we'll just block this off really quick. So, a good way to do it is just leave a little platform that the enemies can spawn on and break it up all around, and then you want to go one more deeper than that so that the water can also flow underneath so we actually be going down here and then just break everything out underneath here and then you have to drop down somehow to get the ones directly underneath as well you just want to break one block or something like that Alright, clear all that out, and break that up. Now let's break this a little bit, just so we can have our area in which we will be hitting the mobs from. Alright. So now let's put a little bit of glass here really quick. Oops, not that one. Not there. Ooh, look. I broke one of my torches. That's okay. Alright. Let's uh, put this one back really quick. It doesn't matter since I'm in creative. They want to attack me. I just don't want them uh, in the way right now. Alright. So now, if you want to drop one level down right here so you can hit their legs and then just start putting the water right here. And it will go right to the edge, but not off. Alright, so just go ahead and break these torches now. Make sure I have my glass up. Break those, break those, and now they will start to spawn. And now you can hit them in the legs. And the good thing about this is you get all of the mob drops, and even the experience will float here away, which is a benefit if you kill them too far away. All right, that's that's pretty much it. Very very simple, easy water mob grinder there. Let's see if any more will come. They do come. It takes them a minute sometimes. But anyway, yeah. Uh, so, there you go. You can use this technique if you want. The only bad thing is sometimes they get stuck back there, but that's okay. Alright, so uh, that's it. I'll talk to you guys next time. Peace out.